long ago. How are you doing today, my brother? My name is Jeremy. I'm here to share a wonderful message with you today. Do you have a moment, sir? This message will truly change your life. Oh, I, I'm so sorry. I don't speak English. Only Samoan. Mm. <laughs> I, I'm sorry. <laughs> oh, you don't speak English? Just Samoan? Ole mamonga. Ole palangi. Mm, sorry, I only speak Samoan. <laughs> no more English. <laughs> oh, my brother, you don't speak English? Oh, you're Samoan. No worries, Uso. Malamalama of a Samoan. Gari! Uso, if I bear oil and oil, it's a palangi for Samoan. I'll wake up a body and lay for it on a gun of a Samoan. Salam for lover. Hello, in my Jeremy Hawkins. As born in Chicago, and when I was a child, my family, we moved to Australia. We were there for about two years. And then we were going to move to Utah in America. So on our way to moving to Utah, we stopped in the islands. We stopped in Samoa, Tahiti, Tonga. And we eventually got to Utah. And when I lived in Utah, I grew up with some wonderful Samoan and Tongan friends. One of the great families that I had was the Ioane family. And when I was living with them, they taught me little phrases. And I started to learn little phrases here and there, but I couldn't really speak it. But when I went to Samoa, I had an understanding of the language. And that's when I started to speak because the some of the Samoan people I was with, they couldn't speak English. So the only way for us to communicate was from speaking in Samoa. So great ways to learn the Samoan language for me was to just listen to people. So these are five phrases that I feel like every individual should know when they go to Samoa. Taro falava, or you can also say Maro soifua. Taro falava, Maro soifua. This means greetings, hello. Owa mai oi. Owa mai oi. This means how are you? This means, where are you from? This means, what is your name? This means, thank you, you have a wonderful day. This means, 